Hey guys, it's Alicia. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are new, welcome. Hit that subscribe button down below and don't forget to hit that bell so you're uploaded, uploaded. updated whenever I make a new video and don't forget to hit that like button. So today is a very big deal, big one, because we're talking about hair and I never talk about hair. I have maybe like three or four videos of me doing hair. But that's really it, and I just never did them again just because I don't I don't do anything fancy to my hair. Like I wish I was like the natural hair channels that like do all of these nice designs with their hair. I I just don't. I'm lazy. I am a lazy curly girl. Wash and goes are my life. A few months ago I um saw this specific brand called Form Beauty and I didn't really know anything about it, so I didn't you know, look too much into it, and then I saw something online, as I realized that it was more about curly hair and stuff like that, I saw something online that like asked you to apply to be a Form Beauty Ambassador. Now I just applied to it, not even thinking that I was going to be a part of it, I just did it just to think it would be a great opportunity, and then all of a sudden I got an email saying to like log into this specific area, and it was literally a forum for those of us that were accepted as a foreign beauty ambassador and um i think a couple days after i joined the forum just getting to talk to these ladies i got two products that's four i got two products in the mail i got a small size of the multitask leave-in lotion which is like a leave-in conditioner and then i got a full size of the define curl cream they were sent to me i did not pay for these my opinion on these products are still 100 percent my own opinions as if I would have gone out and purchased them. There are some stuff from this line that I want to buy anyway, and I'll do reviews on that as well. So don't think that just because these were sent to me that my opinion is on my own and I'm just being, you know, swayed by the fact that these were free, essentially. Every single girl that was in the, um, in the forum or who are beauty ambassadors as well, they each got different products and they didn't just send us all one specific styling thing. Some of us got the defining cream, others got a gel. So I mean, I, I like that, that they kind of just cater to I'm everything. not gonna read every single thing to you guys, but this is what, there we go. This is what the products don't have. All of these, all of it. They don't have any of these things in here. I'll read some of them. So, aceates, aluminum, benzoyl alcohol, um, formaldehyde, acrylic acid, animal fats, um, alcohol in general, coal tar, um, let's see, talc, so See, like they don't test on animals, which I do like a lot. Um, so yeah, it's, it's formulated without a lot of things, which I really do enjoy a lot, because I am an ingredients person. I do pay very close attention to the ingredients that I put in my hair. So after 30 days, if you're not happy with what you got, you can go ahead and return everything. One of the things that I do encourage anybody to do if you are using this product or thinking about it is going all the way down to the bottom of the screen and then it says right here where it says ready to treat yourself um, you have a consultation of exactly what products are formulated for you and that's what I liked a lot that you ask um, they ask you specific questions like if your hair tends to be um, more frizzy or dry is it fine is it coarse normal um, what else did they ask me um, if your hair is typically more in a protective style, keratin treatments, if you're getting hair relaxed, all those kind of stuff, and you do the, um, the questionnaire, and then they give you a whole entire regimen for you to get. So, I had a regimen of six products, which included the multitask and the Define, uh, the Define Elongate, um, Elongating Curling Cream. Um, it also had the Clarifying Detoxing Shampoo, the Gentle Shampoo, the Revive Restorative Conditioner, so they gave me the Restorative Conditioner because I did say that my hair tends to be a lot drier, um, especially now that winter is coming. Sorry, we live right by a school and then kids come this way, so my dog's hair is very dry and they basically put me down for the Restorative Conditioner and then have the Multitask, the Define Elongating Cream, and then the Pomade, and it comes with the different instructions. So I do recommend that if you are interested in getting this product to go online and then use um, the consultation so you're not just kind of getting anything at least this is like formulated specifically for you and that's what I did like Wash and goes I don't do anything fancy with my hair so I don't have the conditioner or the shampoo yet so I went in with my coconut curls 
shampoo and conditioner by Organics. Um, what I do is when it comes to the shampoo, I'll obviously drench my hair and then I'll only shampoo my scalp and then I'll let, um, when I'm rinsing out my hair, I'll let that shampoo work its way down on the strands. So I never really actually shampoo and scrub my hair. I'll just go ahead in my scalp and then rub everything and then sometimes I'll use my nails. I know that's bad, but sometimes I do and then I'll rinse that out. And then what I do is I take the coconut curls um, conditioner and I'll only put this on the bottom half of my hair since that needs the most attention. Um, and then I will comb it out with this comb right here. This is the Conair Double, um, what is it, Duo Ended co um, Comb, I think it's called. This is specifically formulated for curly hair. I know Wee Dot has a comb, but this is like eight bucks, so come on, eight bucks compared to like 20 something, whatever. This is a really good comb, so what I do is I'll take my hair and I'll start from the bottom and then I'll work my way up until I'm at the top and then until I can actually just comb through everything easier. The one thing that I do get frustrated about with my hair is that this side tends to be not as big as my left side, which is irritating, but I've tried everything, but whatever. So I'll do the same thing to both sides. I'll put it up um, and then I'll just finish my whole entire routine, leave the conditioner in for a while. And then what I do, especially if you have a removable shower head, I do recommend this a lot, is to rinse out your hair with cold water like freezing cold closes the shaft in your hair causing for less frizz i do have a little bit of frizz in my hair today but since i use the cold water it's really not as much as if i would just rinse it out with regular warm or hot water um another key is to not rinse out the conditioner completely rinse out just enough but make sure your hair still has a nice slip to it so after that making sure my hair is still completely drenched i went ahead and started using these products now um this is the leave-in lotion the three-in-one styling and it is a spritz and you can either spritz it directly into your hair or you could spritz it into your hand the only criticism that i would have on this is to make one without the spritzer thing because i really just don't like it um i don't like spritz it's a pretty thick consistency let me see if i can get it it's not a fine you get like kind of a fine mist, but then you get chunks like that into your hand. So I mean, for me, I'm just gonna rub that through my hair now, just cause it's there. It has a really nice lemony set, which I do love. But anyway, for me, it kind of just stayed in my hair. Um, and yeah, I just did not like the fact that it had a spritzer to it. So what I usually do is I'll just spray maybe like seven to 10 pumps rub it through my hands, and then I'll put it through each section. Now I typically don't section my hair off in different pieces. What I do is I'll split my hair down the middle and go from this section to this side. So I just use two sections. I don't go through everything, because that's, I'm, like I said earlier, I'm lazy. So I went ahead, spritzed that onto my hands, and then put that, ran that through my hair, and then I combed it out with the comb, and then I went ahead and I used the Define Elongating Cream. A lot of us curly girls, we hate shrinkage I hate shrinkage because you know I think if I stretch out my hair my hair is down to here okay and then it springs back up to my shoulders so I really didn't like that and I've tried so many products that promise elongation and stretching and they don't deliver at all and I will say I had very high hopes for this product that it would stretch out my hair just a little bit and it did. This is first day hair, and it is pretty big. This this is, for me to have first day hair that is this big is a very big deal and elongated. I did not have to stretch on my hair at all. Usually it's definitely a lot more up, and I, I hate first day hair, but I actually went out with confidence with this. Um, another thing that I did notice when it comes to the ingredients is that all the way at the end of it is that it has wheat amino acids. So this is not a gluten-free for me if wheat amino acids or any form of gluten is in a hair product I can't use it um, just because my scalp is incredibly sensitive to that I've had to stop using some of my favorite 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 hair care products because there is wheat amino acids in it I can't use the eco styler olive oil gel which is a staple for me for years Dave products some of the styling products I can't use weed out I can't use because they all have 
we amino acids in it and it just breaks my heart that I can't use them um, so I was very worried that because this was an ingredient in here that it just wouldn't work or my scalp would be on fire but another thing that I want to note is that the wheat amino acids is all the way at the end of the list of ingredients it's not in the middle it's not at the beginning it's at the end and so far I've used this around three times and my scalp has not been irritated I do feel as though that if it was in the beginning of the ingredient list I might not feel the same exact way it might have irritated my scalp a little bit but so far it has not done that um, for this so it comes like a little squeezy bottle it is kind of difficult to get out because you can't this is full but you can't like squeeze it out too much and I can't shake it because it is very thick Jesus it has a soft hold touch is what it promises and that's the consistency of can you see that all right of the cream I'll we'll put it this way it is very thick so I did like that it's not runny or anything like that I don't have a napkin to rinse off my hand God. I do like the thickness of this stuff right here um, like I said there is a little bit of frizz to my hair if I can get closer to the camera there is a little you can see how defined the curls are, but at the same exact time, there is no crunch to them, and I really, really, really enjoyed that. The first time that I did use these products, I absolutely hated them. I used them about a day after I got them, and I think that the first time was definitely my fault because I always finish my hair with a gel, and I use the Earth's Nectar Hair Care Honey Curls. Um, I got this at Sephora, and... I put the products in my hair and then I finished it with a gel and then I diffused my hair. After I did all that, my hair felt dry, like the freaking desert dry. It was horrible. So I was kind of just like, oh my god, what did I do? Like, I'm an ambassador for this thing and I don't even like it. Like, what's happening? And then I was like, you know what? Maybe it is just a gel. Let me give it some time. And then a couple of days after when I was refreshing my curls, I just decided to go in with that cream and then the moisture was brought back into my hair and then today I just used the multitask and that defining cream and this is the result that I got and I also decided to air dry my hair I did not diffuse um, I decided to not diffuse my hair just also not to just see like how it would work but also because I am dyeing my hair um, in a, like a day or two and I just kind of wanted to give some form of rest to my hair when it comes to heat especially since I'm dying. I have to get the conditioner, the shampoo, and then the styling pomade, which I'm very excited to get. But so far, I really do enjoy these products. I am going to do another review on it once I get the rest of the regimen because it's one of those things where it's like you kind of have to use them step by step because I feel like if you use the brand in conjunction with all the other products, it could take your hair to the next and one. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope I informed you as much as I could on this product if you want to buy this product and you take the consultation and you want to try out some of this stuff especially if you want to try the defining curl cream because this is amazing um, click on the link down below use my code um, I don't know it off the top of my head but I'll put it down below um, use my code you get 10% off your purchase on a product that honestly I think is really 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 good and the creators of this brand definitely worked really hard to get it absolutely perfect um, all right, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great rest of the week, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.